Today I'm going to make a mini vase out of pencils and epoxy. So now I need to cut these all in half. So I'm going to do the cover up trick. Okay, there you have it. And then put them all standing up like this. If you haven't already, please subscribe and ring the notification button. It helps me to make it better content. So it's been a while drying now, so I'm now going to take the Pepsi can off the epoxy. So let's get my gloves on and then take it off. I can just peel it off, which is really good. Okay, I've taken off all the mold and it's got this little thing on the end so I'm going to have to cut it across here and then across here and then I'm going to turn it on the lathe. Okay, so I'm in my shop. I've got this both sides cut, I found the middle and now I'm going to attach it onto the lathe and then do some turning. My first ever time turning stacks of colour pencils in a property. Well, disaster struck. If you're looking at this at the moment, you might see that it's not on there anymore. And that's because it flew apart. I'm not gonna give up. I'm gonna glue it back together and keep on turning. I let it dry for about three or four days. So it's time for attempt two. I want to put on all my safety gear because if this does fly off again, I don't want this to be hitting me on, on the face. So let's get my roughing gouge and hope that it doesn't go. So I left this down the rain and what I got in the pencils and now it's all squishy. I squished it back into the form and there's also a crack across there. So I'm going to dry this out with a hairdryer, drill in some super glue, turn it back on the lathe, drill a little hole here and hopefully it turns out okay. So 
So I've dried this out. Now I'm going to chuck it to myself over there. And then he's going to chuck it to myself over there. Got it on the render now. Let's get some super glue and dribble it in the crack here. So I'm now sanding it down to a fine grit. And to varnish this, I'm going to be using some super glue and some tissues. I'm just gonna squirt it on and then rub it on as it goes on. Wow, I couldn't have asked it to turn out any better. It has a really nice shine to it now. Now I'm going to take it off the lathe, put some tissues on each side and drill a tiny little hole. Drilling pencils is so easy, it just slides right in. So I'm over at my mum's um, marigold precious bush. Yeah, so I've got the marigold. I'm going to put it in here. I hope you liked the video of me making the mini bars. Next week, I'll be making a boomerang. Hey Samuel, where's my marigold plant?